Today, I'm speaking with Jim Cooper, Product Manager for CH Products, a member of the APEM family of companies. He's going to give us some insight into key features and applications for joysticks. What are the key features a joystick should have and why is it so important that the joystick feel well constructed? The joystick is the key interface between the man and the machine. It's vitally important that it's reliable. The perception of quality and the perception of the machine itself can be derived from the feel of the joystick and how the joystick performs. If the joystick doesn't move quickly enough, then the operator may well think the machine isn't operating as he would expect and may well blame the machine. It's important for the brand recognition and the brand quality, our end customer, to be thinking about the type of quality of the joystick that they choose. Their quality, brand credibility is always at stake in these sort of applications. Key attributes that you'd be looking for a very smooth feeling joystick, something that was easy to operate, something that was smooth and pleasant to use. Some of these things you can imagine CCTV controls in large casinos are used 24-7. You want something that's very easy to operate. It should have a long life. Something that's being operated 24-7 is getting a lot of use. It should also be intuitive to use. When you walk up to it, you should know how it's going to operate, how it feels, and how it's feeding back information to you. And of course, it should be very reliable. You're looking for at least two, three years worth of operation, in some cases, five, ten years worth of operation. How has the intuitive nature of the joystick made it a natural for precision control applications, and what types of modifications can be made to suit particular users? Well, with machines playing a greater role in modern day operations, humans need a way to interface to them, and the joystick is one of the few devices that provides and responds to feedback. Most customers want something special. Um, they want the joystick tailored to their application. Even for smaller volume applications, people who want tens and twenties of joysticks may well want to have something special to their equipment. There are certain manufacturers who are better capable of producing these, and APEM is one of them. Typical modifications that they might be looking for are to change the spring forces of the joystick, so the joystick is either lighter or heavier to operate. They may well be looking for different handles, shapes, and sizes. In some cases, you might want something small. It gives you the feel of precision. In some cases, you might want something a little bit larger because you want to have the perception of strength. You may well also want to have a larger handle because you want to have additional functions on there, so you might want to have push buttons on there, you might want to have scrolling wheels, in some cases you might even have displays on there. You then have the height above panel and the ergonomics that customers are very interested in. For example, a large piece of equipment where you're operating it with a full hand, you would want a fairly large joystick above the panel. In some cases, you may only want to operate it by the thumb, though, because of the nature of the application, so you'd want something very low. Thank you so much for your time, Jim. We are looking forward to finding out more about CH Products' as joysticks in the next installment of our podcast series. For more information, visit www.chproducts.com.